everybody. Welcome back. Um, I want to say thank you so much to all of my new subscribers for who have just recently... Hello everybody. Welcome back to the Firefly Studio 67. Today we are going to carry on with the postcard challenge uh, from Taddy Treasure, who's here on YouTube. If you haven't seen her channel, check her out. She's got some really, really nice uh, tutorials. So this is the fourth and final week of this challenge. It's been really um, fun to participate in. So thank you, Tanya, for setting this up. She has decided that this one is the promptest twins. So um, I am going to go with these two little Tim Holtz uh, paper dolls and I'm gonna say these are twin girls who their mom has decided that um, she wants a photo of them for autumn holding a basket of apples and they're not happy because they've been dressed the same and they've been asked to pose the same <laughs> So that that's what I'm thinking. Um, I pr wish they were a little bit bigger. I'm a f my my worry is they're going to get lost in this spread, but I just got to go with it. I'm going to try not to overthink it again. I've just pulled out a few things that I'm thinking might possibly get worked into this, but uh, there again, there's just no telling once this gets going. So first thing I'm going to do is grab in some paper. I just purchased this paper um, on my days off this week and this is from Hobby Lobby. It's called Joyful Gathering and I don't normally buy seasonal paper but I just thought you know what I'm getting ready to start a journal and I might actually just do the whole process with you guys. We'll see if I've got the confidence or not. And I just thought, you know what, I'm going to go with it. This paper set I love. So so first thing I want to do, I've got um, some music sheet. And I just thought, I want to get some of this paper on here. Um, so I'm actually just going to tear it and and go with it. So guys, bear with me today. It is 100 degrees and I've got the air conditioning off so that you guys don't have to hear the hum of that, but I will have to have a lot of stops within the video, so I hope that I can make it smooth flowly. <laughs> Sm flow smoothly. Wow, I really did jumble that one up. So do bear with me on that, guys. All right, so let me just think how I want to do this. These little girls, um, I'm trying to figure out the which background they might stand out the, the nicest on. All right, I'm going to get some of this. Paper on them. Get this on. I'm trying not to waste anything, but I might end. I might have made a little bit too much on this, but I want to use these papers. I just, oh, aren't they just fabulous? Actually, I've decided I'm going to put this one on on this side. Like I said, I probably have torn a bit too much paper on that, but that's okay. Whatever scraps I got left here, I can always make some alter paper clips or something like that. Um, you hearing Daisy moving about? She's probably getting a little bit uncomfortable now. It's warming up. She's been sleeping a lot this week, um, but it's probably the best thing for her in this heat. Um, I'm thinking. Alright, so what I thought is to break, I 
kind of want to break these two patterns up. So I just thought it might be nice to have just a little bit of this. Um, okay, I'm going to go with that. I'm just going to snip this off. And let's see here. So I like that. Yep. That's... This is the easy part. It's going to be the placement of everything else that I'm worried about. <laughs> <laughs> but um, I'm just going to go with it, have some fun, and I think this will be kind of cool. I'm saving all of these, and I'm going to get some way to... I've dated everything, and I'm just going to um, either have them on a ring to refer back to because uh, these are just great inspiration to go back and look on. love those colors of course got my teal in there all right so this was just a bit of scrap and I thought mm, maybe to just break this up slightly but then I thought how cute to have the girls sitting on that because they're not very happy And uh, I'm just going to play around with the arrangement and see if I can get something that I like. Okay, guys, so I'm just going to play with these a bit. Because I really... I really think these pieces can work here. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go with that. All right. I'm going to tuck this under. And... Uh, I'm really glad to have a use for this because it's um, not really the colors I would normally work with. Well, to be honest, none of this Tim Holtz really. And so it's really nice to be able to use this stuff up. That I want that to show slightly more because I want her positioned. And I think this is nice because it pulls that yellow out. Um,
Yep. I'm very, very happy with how that came out. Now, let me see. I've got a few more things here. But I think it would be too busy to add any of these stickers. So I'm not going to bother with those. Day is full of possible. Hmm. Don't think that's right. I'll put that one back. It's all perspective. I'm going to go with that one. It's pretty random, isn't it? But I like the gold in these. Um, I think this will look good with everything that's going on. Alright, I'm just going to ink the edges up, guys, and then we're going to see that that one is complete for week four twins very happy with that. Um, I'm enjoying not overthinking things too much. Okay guys, that's what I've created for the final week's challenge. I hope you've enjoyed that, and I'll be back very soon. Take care. Bye-bye.